Hello, it's great to be with you. And no problems at all on the weather front as we get ready for this match. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner Stuart Robson. And we're fully convinced this game will live up to its billing. It's Rochdale up against West Ham United. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. So here is the lineup. Well, this system gives them a good defensive base. A well-drilled back four, a solid midfield with wide players tucking in, and two forwards who can press the ball. But does it provide enough fluidity going forward? I'm never sure. And the starting lineup for West Ham United. Well, on paper, they look a very balanced team. But the three advanced midfielders must at times make runs beyond the centre forward. Otherwise, they might just lack a bit of penetration. Thank you. Enjoy the game. And now they get the ball rolling. Paqueta. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Jimenez this looks interesting can he finish and it goes that will do nicely for starters first goal of the game Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Jared Bowen and now it's Ridley Baku and giving the ball away Cup Mainers what can the Hammers do from this position? sure it didn't get past him Paqueta a really top-notch piece of defending oh the referee points to the sport penalty and it has been judged to have been a bookable offence oh, I think the referee's got that right all round it was a penalty and it was a yellow card And a chance for 2-0. Oh, he's guessed correctly and saved it!
playing it short. And able to get a body in the way. In possession, Mella. Can he find the right pass? Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Jared Bowen. Has a go. The save was a good one. And he's fired over the corner. A very effective clearance. Zuma. And he takes on the shot. Oh, that's textbook goalkeeping. And played short. Promising move. Giving it a try. And there it is, the goal they wanted for security. They lead by two now. They can breathe that bit more easily. Well, here it is again, and credit to the goal scorer. But you have to ask questions of the keeper. He's got to have that near post cover for me. No wonder he's frustrated with himself. So the ball rolling again at 2 0. Cup Mainers. Santiago Jimenez. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment. Real chance. And there it is. Another goal. And surely there's no way back from this now. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. So, back in action, and it's looking rather like a matter of how many for West Ham here. Really good attacking play. Well, he went strongly into the challenge, and the result is a throw in. And the substitution will occur now. Corner awarded. And there's the delivery. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. So a throw in here. Just the challenge that was required. And the flag does go up, must have been tight.
Well, as you can see, West Ham have had most of the ball and have used it really well today, particularly in the midfield areas. And I expect more of the same as the game goes on. Yes, really going so well for them. And who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. Santiago Jimenez. It's with Cop Mainers. It should be! Well, trying to place it, but without any great success. Well, maybe went for the wrong technique. If he'd have hit it with power, he may have got a better result. That's a poor effort, really. Liam Kelly. Manor. In the right place to cut out the pass. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Tomas Socek. Every pass hitting its target. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Ian Henderson. Kelly. And snuffing out the danger. Cop Mainers. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Credit to them for winning back possession. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Oh, he's lost possession. In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. Well, we won't get tired of watching this because the interplay around the box is wonderful. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. Well, slightly off target, and that'll be a throw-in. Baku. Excellent vision. And reading it absolutely superbly. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. Well, there's a good reason why we're highlighting him. He's really dominating in attack in this game, Stuart. Well, he's looked sharp, hasn't he? Yes, he scored a good goal, but his general play has been excellent. I've enjoyed watching him today. This looks interesting. And so the second half commences here. And it was one-way traffic in the first half. They're going to need all their time if they have designs on a comeback. Cup Mainers. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Can they take advantage of the situation? Paqueta, an interceptor there. Can he finish? A goal! We're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is.
My goodness, it's so one-sided. 5-0 in this match. Quigley, and a fine tackle. Plenty of support here. Unable to keep the ball that time. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Paqueta. And blocked for now. Ian Henderson. They all know their roles as they apply the pressure. This looks threatening. Will it happen for them? Shot attempted. And it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop him. Well, here it is again, and he's just passed that into the net. That's a very good finish, you have to say. Some out and out pasting. 6 0. 30 minutes left for play. This is a message for Andy Tobin. That's Andy Tobin. Can you please return to your vehicle immediately? Over the touchline for a throw in. No way through. Can they hit on the break? And the keeper can gather. Well, West Ham regaining possession. It might be. What a performance! Yeah, here's the setup play. Well, it's a great little back heel, isn't it? And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Well, we're underway again, and this game was finished as a contest a long time ago. Under pressure, doesn't seem to be bothering him. And they know they need to stop him. Possession changing hands. They're really pressing their opponents. Paqueta, Santiago Jimenez, now with Ben Rahma, and he's going to be disappointed with that pass, counter-attacking very much an option, well it fizzled out, Rodney 
An effective challenge. Might be onto something with that ball. Well, far from the ideal pass. Just ten minutes to go. Nicely timed tackle. Jared Bowen. Socek. Santiago Jimenez. Oh, surely. And just too much height on the shot. Said Ben Rama. Cup Mainers. There to win it back. He's going forward well here. Paqueta. Ian Henderson. And they stopped them in their tracks. So three minutes of stoppage time it'll be. Ings. And he could really get at the opposition. Well, no problems defensively. Substitution for West Ham United. Coming off the pitch, number 22, Saeed Ben Ryan. Now, how about the short corner? A glorious chance! So that will do it for this game. It is officially a final score now, and West Ham get the win and the three points. What did you think of their overall performance? Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? I was particularly impressed with their play going forward. Really lively, almost cutting through at will at times. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest. Santiago Jimenez. Moving the ball effectively, looking for the right moment.